And police hope new video may help ID the person who carjacked a couple at an Orlando park and raped the female victim at gunpoint. It happened last Friday on Rose Bay Drive near Clarcona Okoe Road. That's where Channel 9's Angela Jacobs joins us live. And Angela, detectives have not said where the cameras were that caught these pictures. Vanessa, we know the attack happened in this parking lot, and there are cameras we saw on the entrance of this nearby building. But no matter where this video came from, detectives now hope it leads to an arrest. Take a good look at this five seconds of video. This is the suspect police believe held a man and woman at gunpoint at an Orlando park before sexually assaulting the female victim and stealing the couple's car. Detectives say to pay attention to the suspect's clothing and the way he walks. It happened June 29th around 3 o'clock in the morning at the Rosemont Community Center Park. Police say the man in this sketch was armed with a handgun when he walked up to the couple and forced them out of their car. News spread like wildfire about what happened. This lifeguard has worked at the park's pool the past six years. He didn't recognize anyone when we showed him this latest video, but hopes someone will. Even though the incident happened well after the park's official hours, he told us it's had an effect on its tight-knit community. Kids out here all the time and counselors, and it's a very kid-friendly environment, so hearing something like this happen is just really shocking. Police say the man and escaped in the victim's dark blue 2015 Hyundai Sonata, similar to the one in this picture. They want the public to keep a lookout for both the suspect and that car. It'll definitely be relief when they uh, get captured. And back out here live, since we were out here earlier this week, this reward has now been posted, offering $5,000 for any information leading to an arrest in this crime. Reporting live in Orlando, Angela Jacobs, Channel 9, Eyewitness News.